Yes. Roll into the course in a lap of luxury. Here we go. Starts right up. Glad we spent that cool G to get her fixed. Let's go seat belt. Work with me. Work with me. We don't have time for this today. Safety is important. But you know what? Golf is more important. So let's go. Sorry. Usually we wake up our neighbors with the loud exhaust, but uh, this time it's the squeaking noise of a Rolls Royce limousine. We need that seat belt. We need it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Win win. We're golfing and we're wearing our seatbelt. Also, we got a massive bird poo on our windshield and I don't know if you can see, but the spray, uh, it doesn't hit the windshield, it sprays over there. So yeah, we're gonna have to deal with that. And I apologize, I'm giving you guys such a terrible view of, of a, a bird poo, but this is the best I could do for you. Don't view it as a reflection of how I view you all. I had to get a quick pick me up from the Mav and getting out of here is gonna be awkward. Come on, come on. There we go. Works every time. I think I'm gonna go for the less awkward situation. And I'm just gonna go the long way. Yeah. Because, oh, come on, baby. Come on, come on. You're embarrassing yourself, girl. Two things to note. I won again with the seatbelt, safety first. And second, I'm not gonna make you guys watch me golf for 18 holes, don't worry. We're gonna kinda jump ahead a little bit. This bird turd, though, it's just like, it's like, Dead center. Yeah. I already got a few people out here like, what the heck is going on here? Yeah, I'm gonna have to take up two spots. It's gonna be awkward. We're gonna check with you guys after the round. What a glorious day. Round is over. Time to go to CarMax. Oh, I played, I played decent for once. Finally. Yes. All right, I gotta shower up, then CarMax. All right, hold up everyone. Before we get too far into this and find out what CarMax thinks the Rolls limo and the Hummer H2 are worth, we need to stop and acknowledge and thank one of our sponsors of this video, Surfshark. Surfshark is a VPN and they are the VPN that you need to be using. And I appreciate their support for sponsoring some exciting things we have coming up on this channel. And if you use the code Burlacker, you can save up to 85% and three months free. Now you may be wondering why you need a VPN from Surfshark. Well, I I'm glad you asked because you need to shield your online presence, protect your personal info, and protect your ID. It's also great for traveling because it saves mobile roaming data, protects your device from data thieves, and you can access your favorite content anywhere like idiots. Since I also have a day job, it's important that I protect the information that I'm working on, whether I'm traveling or not, and a VPN by Surfshark is the solution for that protection. Now, some of the pros of Surfshark is you can use it on an unlimited number of devices. No other VPN allows this. There are apps for all types of software, iPhone, Android, and, and so forth. You get 24 seven customer service support, 30 day money back guarantee, so it's risk free, and there are strictly no logs. No one knows what you're doing, not even Surfshark themselves. Now, remember to use the code Burlacker or click in the link in the description below to unlock an 85% discount. That is the best pricing in the market, and on top of that, you get three months free. Now, that's what I call a hole in one. I know we gotta go eat, but I got a bird turd that uh you're not gonna get more money for it actually this is just for driver safety it's right in my eye line all right food yes where are we going Bobettas. boom so the wipers here they used to work and now it seems they don't we got a massive head start on james which we needed because this thing uh struggles just to go to the speed limit but i'm pretty sure he's gonna come uh flying by any second I brought the tow truck with us. That was smart and just I appreciate that. Yeah, I know you're welcome. You just got him on retainer. You're leaning to one side. This is the ugliest thing I've ever seen on the road. Yeah, but I get, I bet you I get more attention than you. This thing is not the uh, straightest car. It's bouncing, it's weaving, it's dodging on the road, hopping around, and driving next to a $240,000 Lamborghini Aventador. Uh, uh, yeah, I was a bit, uh, it was a bit nerve wracking. Question. Yeah. Was that amazing? <laughs> yeah, it was, yes. it really was. It was phenomenal. Whew. Okay, you're going to see your land. Link to his channel and video below. Oh, 
I'm going no, to CarMax. You're not going to link. You're going to be going way to too lazy no, I'm going to link it. No, I'm going to link it. You got to so, copy. You got to paste the link nah, in the description. It's going to take forever. We have the bet. James thinks they'll value the the limo at seven thousand and up, and I'm going to go six nine 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 and below. I am not confident about that, though. I just want to make that clear. I like, think it's 50, not, 50, 50, Honestly, 50. they should charge you to take it. I am going to miss the way this starts where the key is, though. I love that. CarMax, here we are. CarMax. Yeah, baby. Rolls. Moment of truth. All right, we got our offer, and I'm going to keep you guys on the hook because we're going to go get the Hummer. We're going to come back. We're going to get that offer, and then we're going to talk about the values. So I'm uh, quite uh, surprised and pleased with what they offered. I will say this though, I am gonna miss driving the limo. It's just kind of a comical, fun vehicle and super rare. Next up, the big yellow. One reason I need to figure out what to do with those cars is because this is just a travesty, a mess, a disaster. Remember, Tyler at Hoovy's Garage sold it to me for $6,500, which was the deal of the century, honestly. Look at it, look at it, it's like priceless. Oh, reliable. Hummer, boom. I gotta tell you, it's so weird to get out of the Rolls Royce and jump into a Hummer. Both vehicles I never thought I would ever own at any point in my life, and they are so different, so different, but they're both very comfortable. Now you might ask why I'm even taking the Hummer to CarMax, because I never want to get rid of it. So it's mainly just because I'm curious, because I don't ever want to get rid of it. I love this car, but also because I'm, I might be getting rid of it. All right, here we are, take two. I wonder if they're gonna offer more or less. I know they're totally different vehicles, but you think they'll offer more for the Hummer than the Rolls? All right, they gave the car a look over, they got their information. Now we're just waiting for the offer. All right, we got our offer, and I forgot to tell you guys what my guess was gonna be beforehand, and now I, I can't because I know, so guessing is irrelevant, but it's right where I thought it was gonna be. Now, what we're gonna do with that, maybe we keep it, maybe we sell it, but I will say this, Grand would go a long way towards horsepower modifications in a Shelby GT350. I would really miss the three sunglass holders though. That's just a feature that I don't know if I'm ready to give up. Is that worth something like more horsepower in a Shelby GT350? I don't know. Weed control. I gotta do a couple loops each time to knock down the weeds in the backyard. Speaking of which, we might have some news in the backyard soon, maybe, maybe not. I'm talking to people, stay tuned. Okay, I won't keep you guys in suspense anymore. Oscar's dying to know. Let me go tell you what they offered for the rolls. Let's go talk some numbers. Let's go. I know you wanna know. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I know you're dying to know. This is your favorite car. This is what CarMax offered. Yeah, sit down because this is gonna shock you, they offered us zero dollars. That's right, the offer was zero. They do not sell or deal limousines. Not because it was a Rolls Royce, limousines. CarMax does not do limousines. So that means you get to keep your favorite car forever, because I don't know how we're ever gonna sell this, which he is excited about, as you can tell. CarMax was the easy way out. If they're not gonna buy it, I don't know. We'll let Oscar ponder on that for a minute. Let's go talk about the Hummer offer. And yes, we actually got an offer for the Hummer, so let's go. You wanna know what we got for the Hummer? Cause I know that's your second favorite car. So let's go, I'll tell you. Let's go. Come on. You don't wanna leave. There we go. I can't blame him. I never liked to leave the limo either. That's why I lived in it for 24 hours. Legit. Now they offered a lot more for the Hummer than they did the Rolls, which obviously the Rolls was zero, but effectively that means a Hummer H2 is worth more than a Rolls Royce? Okay, this is a stretch, but that's how we're gonna spin it. Either way, the fact is they offered $4,000 for the Hummer H2. Now I bought it from Tyler Hoovy's Garage a couple months ago for $6,500. That's a $2,500 loss after just a couple months. Uh, not smart, maybe I can get more, sell it somewhere else, but maybe I don't wanna sell it, but maybe I have plans for that money for other things. So maybe I do need to sell it. And as they say, on that bombshell, I got dinner plans, so I gotta bounce out. Wish you guys the best of luck. Go crush it. Peace.